Hi, this is Katie Tunstall. You're watching Mariners TV. So we're going to took a while and come, but it got there in the end. Were you pleased with the way that you got over the line in the end? Yeah, just a, another thoroughly professional performance. Um, you know, we got here and stepped out on the pitch and uh, realised straight away how difficult it was going to be. Um, obviously, as you've seen, the pitch was so lively, um, so bobbly. Uh, we had to come up with a different plan and uh, we've done it really well. You know, I thought there were some really strong performances out there today. Um, you know, Matty Parson was excellent throughout. Dylan um, Finners having to do a central midfield role as well. When Jules came off injured, he, he more than played his part as well. And, and everyone chipped in and uh, were delighted with the win. You had a lot of patience here as well, was it about not trying to force it in those close Yeah, we, had, well? we obviously, the first half was a little bit too and fro for 10 minutes and we got on top and we, we looked comfortable. Um, it was difficult first half down the wind with the wind. Sorry, downhill with the wind. Um, the ball was running out of play a lot, um, but we had a couple of stuffs. The, the clearance off the line from Matty was um, obviously a, a big moment in the game. Um, but then, yes, yeah, second half we knew it was going to be a little bit easier in terms of the ball holding up for us um, when we're going over the top. And uh, a little bit of magic so won as the game. Um, just thought the, the play in the corner with, with Craig and Patter. Um, Decided to just fire it across the box and in them instances, as long as you get your, your time and movement right and, and Graham's just getting anything on it and uh, he's almost steered it in the far corner there, brilliant finish. What's your pleased with Graham as well because he had a frustrating time the last time he was on the pitch with you? Yeah, no, we're, we're delighted for Graham, you know, you can never accuse Graham of not trying, he's, he's putting every single ounce of energy he's got into every time he gets on the pitch and um, we're delighted for him getting the goal today, he deserves it. So the chance of the title today as well. How were we at Scarborough Scorer? Yeah, Phil, Phil was keeping us updated. Obviously, when they went a goal behind, we're getting a little bit excited there. But um, yeah, we have to wait until um, either Tuesday, Thursday, or hopefully not Saturday. I was say Tuesday's game against Radcliffe Wade puts an extra bit on that, on that one now, doesn't it? You must be confident that you can get the job yeah, done. Yeah, look, we, we know it'll probably be similar conditions. We don't know until we get there. We don't know what Radcliffe's pitch is like. It'll, it'll be similar. Um, so, yeah, we're, we're obviously looking forward to the game. Hopefully we can get it done Tuesday. If not, we've obviously got uh, two more attempts on Thursday and Saturday to get the job done. You mentioned Hulu's injury before as well. Do you think he's likely to be out for one or two games? Or? I mean, like, yeah, when, when you, you kind of hold your hand up with a, um, a hamstring injury, um, it doesn't look great. Um, I don't know. We don't know until Andy assesses it, so we'll see over the next few days, see if it settles down. Um, I don't really want to comment on that one too much at the moment. We always mention the supporters as well, but this was the final Saturday away trip of the season as well. What would you like to say oh, about the supporters today? They were unbelievable. Today? Man. They were unbelievable today. From we we were out doing the warm up before, and they came in the uh, in the gate, um, and they were just non-stop singing from that moment and, until obviously now, and uh, we're just hu hugely appreciative again of the the time, um, money, effort. Um, and commitment to the football club that they show every week. I guess games like this as well, when it's not quite going for you all the way through as well, it's important that they stick with you, isn't it? And of course. Yeah, the no, they, I mean, I think they understand how, how difficult it is out there. It's not, you can't get down play our normal brand of football. It's just impossible to do that. You would struggle to get a Barcelona team trying to do, trying to play on this pitch. So you have to adapt your game. And, and that was the pleasing thing about today. We, we adapted and we did well, um, obviously just, just playing a different style today. But I think, like you say, the fans kind of appreciated that we couldn't do our normal our normal style and, and, and how to adapt. It's funny, you've mentioned Hulu has injuries, obviously a couple more out as well, like the Lee Mason and, and Barry Smith as well. Do you think any of them got the chance so to choose? Um, we're, we're not sure. Um, we'll have to wait. So hopefully Barry might be there and thereabouts and, and Mason we're, we're not too sure about now. So again, we'll let Andy do his job and... And hopefully, fingers crossed, at least before the end of the season, we might see those two uh, part of the squad.